think this should be a bit of a different type of morning routine compared to ones you may have seen before. For those of you who don't know me, if this is the first video you're seeing from me, hi, my name is Lauren. I'm a senior studying chemical engineering at the University of Rhode Island. And this is my morning routine for my final semester of undergrad, spring semester 2024. So this semester I've set 6.30 as my wake up time. In the fall, I had a bunch of 8 a.m.s and my schedule was absolutely crazy. So I was going to the gym first thing in the morning. That meant I was waking up at 5.30. This semester, my schedule looks a little bit different. So I decided to give myself that extra hour of sleep. My alarm goes off at 6.30. The very first thing I like to do after I roll out of bed and make my bed is get dressed because I feel like it helps me wake up a little bit. I'm no longer in cozy clothes and ready to start my day. There is something about getting to drink coffee out of an actual mug instead of taking it to go on a travel mug or whatever. It's just so nice. I never thought something as simple as that would bring me so much joy. Cheers. Something also new for this spring semester is that while I'm drinking my coffee or sometimes it's a little bit before or after, I have a magic mind shot. Now, if you follow me on Instagram and have seen any of my daily vlogs there, you've definitely seen how this has been an integral part of my morning routine since about mid-January, like right before I got back to school. At first, I was definitely a little bit skeptical because I was like, how does this legit two ounce shot help with productivity and stress levels? But after about three days, three or four days of taking it consistently, I've noticed that my ability to reach the flow state has been that much easier. I found out that this is due to the nootropics inside, like ashwagandha, L-theanine. I really, really recommend giving this a shot if you're trying to increase your motivation or your productivity for this semester or whatever you're doing in life. Also for me, I was really impressed with the resources available on Magic Minds website. They have all the ingredients listed out with peer-reviewed sources cited underneath each ingredient so you know exactly what's in there and what it's doing for you. So with all that being said, if you wanna give Magic Mind a try, I do have a link in the description and a discount code. This will give you up to 56% off a Magic Mind subscription. And you can give it a try. Definitely be consistent for the first few days that you're taking it, at least four or five days. If you don't like it or if you're not seeing any effects, Magic Mind will refund you 100% with no questions asked. So yeah, hit that link in the description if you're just a little bit curious, check out their website, see what Magic Mind could possibly do for you. All right, don't forget to shake it. So after I've had my Magic Mind, I'm sipping on my coffee. I typically spend about 10 to 15 minutes on my laptop checking up on any emails I may have received and just trying to plan out my day. Today is Wednesday and my first class doesn't start until 9 a.m. On Monday, Wednesday, my class starts at nine and on Tuesday, Thursday, they start at 9.30. So it makes my schedule pretty consistent. No matter what the day is, I normally do some very, very light makeup. And then I'll eat breakfast and head out the door. For breakfast this morning, I'm feeling some eggs and toast. So let's get it done.
It is 7.53, got my car. I typically try to be in the car between 7.45 and 8, so we're right on schedule. Just got to campus with a little less than an hour before my class starts. I like to get here nice and early, no matter the day, so that I can beat the traffic, get a nice parking spot. It eliminates a lot of stress for me. Let's go into the engineering building. I'm gonna get some work done there. I'll see you in a bit. It's Just made it into lab. Typically when I get here early, I either go into lab to do some cell culture or complete just a quick task that will take me less than an hour, or I get some other classwork done, some studying, some homework, whatever it may be. I have like 45 minutes to get a few things done. So this morning I'm here in the lab, gonna check on my cells, and then we're gonna head to class. Forty-five minutes went by super fast. I have to head downstairs to my one and only class of the day. It's senior lab and today my group is working on a cooling tower experiment. The class runs from 9 to 11.50 so it makes up the majority of my morning. like that senior lab is done and my morning is actually almost complete we were able to get out of class a little bit early today so I'm back to my car at 11 30 I'm gonna head home and probably make some lunch but we'll see I'll keep you guys posted We are back home. Honestly, this is really unexpected. I thought I was gonna be on campus for the full day, which is why I made and packed a lunch. But because Senior Lab got out early and I had a meeting get canceled, I get to come back home. It is just about noon now, so the morning is over. That was my typical morning routine. This stays pretty consistent Monday through Thursday. Friday looks a little bit different because I don't have classes. I still get work done and go to the lab sometimes, but yeah, this is my routine for Monday through Thursday when I have classes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got something out of it. I feel like my routine in particular isn't very typical, so that's why I wanted to share it. If you liked this video, please don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all those normal YouTube things because it really, really helps me out. Don't forget, if you want to try Magic Mind, hit that link in the description. It also will be in the comment section down below. Use my code to get you up to 56% off. Definitely try it and let me know if you do. Stay happy, stay healthy out there, everybody, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!